I did a cop knock, boom, 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 and said, get out, the building's on fire. And a developing story we are hearing from that man right there who helped his neighbors escape from their burning apartment in East Tulsa. That apartment is in the area where Highway 169 and I-44 intersect. Fox 23's Jenna James shows us the damage left behind and what the Red Cross is doing to help. Neighbors from eight units at the Oak Brook Apartments had to evacuate Wednesday morning after the attic caught fire and spread. Came back from the store and that's what I saw. It wasn't the wake up call they asked for at the Oak Brook Apartments Wednesday morning. Looked up the stairs and uh, ha half the ceiling through the breezeway was involved in the fire. Everything was already starting to fall so all I had time to do was knock on doors. The fire started just after 6 a.m. Right around that time, a neighbor who didn't want to show his face on camera was just getting Getting home. He saw the smoke and acted quickly. I did a cop knock, boom, 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 and said, get out, the building's on fire. People just said, what? You know, yelled like, there's nothing that loud. And I just said, you know, building's on fire, get out, and went to the next one. And then came back by the ones I saw that didn't go out. Andy Little with Tulsa Fire Department says that multiple people driving by on I-44 and Highway 169 saw the smoke pouring from the roof and called 911. Almost entirely the damage is in the attic area. Uh, in, in two of the units, there's minor fire damage. Uh, but of course, there's going to be smoke damage in that entire building as the, as the smoke, you know, filled those units. People who escaped the fire tell me they don't know where they'll stay. Thankfully, the Red Cross has stepped in. In East Tulsa, covering news that matters, Jenna James, Fox 23 News.